This is probably the weirdest drum set I've ever played in my life. What the f is this? The guys over at Lakato asked me to review their product and they sent me over a portable drum set. That's an entire electric drum set that you can sit on the top of a table. And like I said, it's portable. You can even put it away in a bag and take it with you on trips or wherever you're going. It's got everything a beginner drum set would have. It's got the three toms, a crash, hi-hat, ride. You even get the pedals for the hi-hat control and the kick drum. So I haven't opened it up yet, but let's go ahead and check it out and see what we got inside the box. All right, right off the bat, this is a pretty small box and we have an entire drum set in this thing. So what we have here is from the brand Lakato. This is their CPD 1000 electric drum. Couldn't find my box cutter so I just pulled out some uh, needle nose pliers. And inside we have the bag or the case for this electronic drum set. Now mind you everything fits in this bag and it's even got straps so you can carry it with you anywhere you go. Let's open this bag up and see what we got inside. All right, first thing we got is the mount for the module. And of course, our trusty owner's manual. Now we got three of these cymbal pads, which are basically just rubber triggers that'll be sitting on top of the, uh, the drum set. They're pretty small, as you can see, all three of them fit in my hand. Of course, now we got the beautiful module. Pretty straightforward module. You got your kit, coach. Uh, I guess that's gonna help you learn some stuff. Songs, you got your output volume, you got your headphones volume. Voice, so you can change what sound is coming out of the trigger. All right, let's remove the styrofoam from the rubber feet on this thing because you can set it up on a tabletop and play it that way. There you have it. You got your three toms and snare all in one piece. And this is a metal frame, so it's pretty sturdy. It's not like it's gonna fall apart on you really. There are a couple loose screws if you can see here on the video, but uh, I'm just going to leave those the way they are. Now we got a box that comes with your drum key, a couple screws, and your 9 volt line adapter. Now if we go to the pockets on the outside of the bag, we got, hey, you got some drumsticks ready to play this thing as soon as you buy it. We got the arms for the cymbal triggers. I'm not sure how to install those, but we'll figure that out in a minute. And of course, your cable snake. Now this is kind of interesting to me. These are the pedals for the hi-hat control and the kick drum. They are very small <laughs> and they're just, they're just, they're, I don't really know how to describe them. They're just very small and thin and uh, kind of worrisome, but we'll check those out here in a minute. Now instead of putting this thing on a tabletop, I'm actually going to put mine on a snare stand. I saw someone else do it in another video, so I'm going to try to figure it out. Unfortunately, I couldn't do it the way they did it in their video. I couldn't figure it out, so I just opened the snare stand all the way up and set this drum set right on top of it. That seems to be the best way to uh, keep it sturdy. That way when I play it, it doesn't fall over, it doesn't wobble around or anything. Also in the owner's manual, it doesn't really tell you anything about setting it on the snare stand. It just wants you to put it on a tabletop. All right, now we're gonna start putting this thing together. I'm going to install the module that actually goes underneath the drum set and you use these screws to screw down into it and you got two screws to go into the back of the module and your modules hooked on your set now it took me a minute to figure out these cymbal arms they didn't really make too much sense to me i thought you were supposed to put them through the bottom up uh that didn't work out then i figured out you just have to unscrew this rubber tip on it and then you were able to put it down into the drum set and there you go you just screw it in place with your drum key and now you have your cymbals. Rinse and repeat with the other two, and now we have a fully assembled drum set. Now that that's assembled, all we gotta do is plug in everything with this cable snake, and we're good to go. As you can see here, we got three different cables. We got one for the hi-hat control, kick switch and the kick drum now those two kick switch and hi-hat control those are going to go for the little foot pedals that came with the drum set that kick drum cable you have right there is optional if you had another electronic kick drum pad you would use this cable to plug into that so you would use that instead instead of this little kick switch they gave you so i could be using the uh, elisa's kick i have in the background here but I'm just going to stick with this one that they gave us and work with the drum set as it is. All right, now that we got everything hooked up, I'm going to hook it straight into my computer and we're just going to play with the sounds that are in the actual module. Mm -hmm. 